today's lesson, the students are learning about the different layers of soil. We'll be doing this by making dirt cups. We will also be reviewing chemical reactions, weathered rocks, produces and decomposes. This lesson is part of the Science April Acceleration Academy at the Tarbuck School. I'm using chocolate chips to represent bedrock with, at the bottom of the cup, which represents the bottom layer of soil made up of solid rock. The Orioles represent the subsoil. The subsoil is a combination of weathered rocks and soil. You get weathered rocks from little sediments that fall off a big rock. And weathered um, sediments come off a big rock from winds, roots, ice, cold, pressure, water, rain, acid rain, and animals. When we are making the pudding, it represents the topsoil. The topsoil provides nutrients in the soil to the plants. We are combining the, the atoms from the pudding mix with the atoms of the milk and together they form a new substance. The milk atoms and the pudding mix atoms are not destroyed, however, they are just rearranged into a different pattern. This whole process is a chemical reaction. What I'm doing is adding food coloring to the coconut, which represents the grass. The grass is a producer which takes energy from the sun and makes its own food from it, which is called photosynthesis. The gummy worms are going to be used uh, as de decomposers. Um, decomposers break down raw plants uh, and animals and uh, add nutrients uh, to the soil, make soil fertile and good for farming. Other examples are mushrooms, centipedes, uh, and bacteria. 